So it was about three years ago that we started the adoption process. And in the beginning, I guess we were trying to adopt a newborn baby. We never even really thought about older we children. We never thought about older You just older are trying to have a baby this whole time and baby, baby, babies, everything on your mind. And then one day we said, well, why aren't we looking at older kids? Mm-hmm. And that's the day we found Summer. After we saw her on Boys and Girls Aid website and we inquired about her, um, Boys and Girls Aid was able to facilitate phone calls with her DHS caseworker, as well as her current foster parent, and so we could ask questions. The adoption process is really stressful for her and for children, and I think before she came, she was really stressed out. Life before I got here was very complicated because um, I had to move around a whole bunch. Um, because I was going through so much stress about my f uh, first adoptive parents, of them saying that they don't want me anymore, it was just really hard around that time and that I didn't know if they um, actually still like loved me or anything and if they wanted to keep me and I was going through some hard things about that because I was like worried that I would have to go through more and I'd have to get, um, they would throw me on the streets or something. When she first came here, she was very lethargic. Um, she would eat a lot to try to keep herself awake. Um, and she had a lot of appointments and other things that kids in care needed to get done. Not having that relationship in the past makes it harder to go through those situations. Um, but you make it through those. Um, and that's how you grow together as a family. The first time she came to the house, um, she didn't spend the night the first time. And we're seeing her leave, like, no, she belongs in our home. She's our daughter. We want her here. Day three, we went to OMSI together. <laughs> and we were in the gift shop and Summer and you know, I'm walking in front of Summer and Summer comes up from behind me and she's like, mom, mom. And I didn't turn around because I've never been called mom before. <laughs> and so she had to grab my shirt and be like, Rochelle. <laughs> <laughs> um, that was a joke to this day. It's incredible that I've actually got somebody, like some parents that actually trust and respect and, and actually give me chances as a daughter. My favorite thing about my dad is that he can play around around anything. He can joke around even when it's a hard time. He can make me smile. He can make me laugh when I'm having a hard day. He cried when he saw me the first time. I cried. It was awesome. That was, was a great day. the best experience ever. That was a great day. She ran to us. My favorite thing about my mom is that she's always there. She will be there for me. She will defend me for anything that she thinks is right. She was our daughter that first day that we saw that picture of her and decided that we wanted to adopt her. She was our daughter that day. And I think Boys and Girls Aid knew that. They knew that. Yeah. They knew us and they knew her well enough to know that. I'm going to a regular school. I am learning new things, coping skills, because I'm in one stable home and I know that they will not give me up. 